I actually started to uh, plan the picture about 1935, and I fooled around with it, uh, trying to get a hold of a story and things for a couple of years, and finally it began to gel, then I was, uh, went to work on it, and I finished it in the fall of 1938. I didn't know what I had or what would happen or anything. We had the getting music with Spakovsky. <laughs> well... Hi everyone, I'm back home, I'm at my parents' house, this is my cat, this is my little brother. So like I said, um, I just arrived, I didn't want it to film any sort of intro video about like traveling montage, like planes and how I'm getting into the buses and stuff like that in London, so I just decided to start filming and everything from here, like from scratch. I think I'm gonna just set up my board and I'm gonna go skateboarding, I think. Uh, by the way, my house is really, really close to the skate park and really, really close to the beach. So I'm gonna, guys, take you maybe to the beach later or I'm gonna take you to the skate park. I'm gonna film something skate park. But it's gonna be just like a chill warm up day, you know, like nothing really too serious because I'm so tired. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna relax and yeah, but it's very windy. All right, so. Let's check, where's my skateboard? I have no idea. Where is the skateboard though? Do you want to go outside? Do you want to go out? Okay, let's go outside. Okay, baby. I'm back in my room. I'm gonna replace the, the wheels. I brought brand new wheels uh, to set up with my board. Yeah, these are heavier. These wheels are better. Okay, that's it. I think this is how it looks like. Yeah, actually, I mean, these wheels are bigger than the ones I had before. So this is my setup. Like, cliche board, bones wheels, uh, destructor trucks, um, and reds, bones reds bearings. That's it.
Varēsi? Tad jau no tās ir tu pamaiņot, jā. Tu labi Es sāku man iesaldīt tas viņu, es tev viņu tev dīvaini. Jā, labi. Heading out to the countryside. Just gonna be some quality barbecue time with the uh, family. So we arrived in a deep ass of Latvian countryside nowhere. And I'm I'm actually I got something very very exciting to show you guys. Can you hear that? Can you hear this? The frog sounds. Yeah, so this is, I don't even know where I am now, but I've got something really exciting to show you guys. So, as you can see, maybe from here, there's this, uh, there's a stork nest over there. Over there, yeah. And there's a stork with a couple of little babies. So now what I wanna do, I wanna bring out my drone. And I, want to, I, want to, I would like to try to film a stork nest from above. I think it would be awesome. And then maybe some other stuff as well.
Okay, folks, we just arrived in my countryside house where I used to grow up. I spent most of my summers it's in a city called Pavlovsta. It's uh, 50 kilometers uh, from the city where I was studying, where I graduated my school. This is a really small town, like approximately 1,000 people. Uh, very popular for the rich Latvians. They spend most of the summers over here. Uh, this town is also very popular for windsurfing. There are a lot of competitions happening um, and Yeah, uh, it's a very beautiful beach and I'm gonna show you later How the beach looks like and I'm gonna take you to the beach Let's have a game a little lovely game of Roman ping-pong like two civilized senators Roman ping You're supposed to say Roman pong I remember when I was a kid, uh, we were coming over here and we were actually jumping into the sea from here, from that edge part. I was always terrified, I was so scared. I jumped maybe two or three times only. I don't know, I, I've been always scared of jumping into the water from big heights. So now I'm gonna try to climb up here, as you can see. Like there's like a wire and then you can just go up over there to the top I'm just kind of try to get it over there and maybe take some pictures or film something from above so see you later I used to jump from here. Fucking so scary. I, I still feel scared actually. Okay, let's go up.
Uh, hi folks, um, I'm now at my dentist place. I'm just gonna go in. I'm actually a little bit scared. I don't really like dentists at all, so it's been like four years since I've seen my dentist. So now I'm gonna go in and check my teeth out. We'll see, maybe she'll gonna go do some work and I'll get some anesthetic and then we'll see. Hey guys, so I just got back home from dentist. Um, everything's all right. I just need to go back maybe in six months to just uh, just to fix the last filling and uh, last teeth. And now, actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take you to my old school where I used to study. Oh, there's a car who's gonna hit me. Yeah, I'm gonna take you to my school where I used to study, where I, my early days, starting from eight years of age, I'm gonna show you where is my primary school and where is my secondary school. And you know what? I think there's a graduation thing happening at the moment. So I just wanna show you the graduation, how it's happening in my country. So this is my primary school behind. I started to study here when I was eight years old. I came from a countryside city, it's like a small town, to this city. And then I got into this school over here behind me. And I was there for four years. And then I moved to a secondary school, which is just next to it, over there. take you inside I'm gonna show you how it looks from inside it's a bit exciting and nervous I had too many people over there. I kind of get into the main hall room. They were singing some fucking songs and a song. So I'm gonna show you where was my chemistry class. And I'm gonna show you maybe some other classrooms. I like everything so brown. <laughs> so, yeah, I remember this place. So, this used to be. This one over here was, used to be my chemistry class. 
and just next to it, it was um, biology class or anatomy. I remember once I was, we were just doing some pranks and then I remember I put in the, a little piece of match inside of the, over here in a key, key lock. And the thing was that we couldn't get inside of the classroom for like 15 minutes because the mechanics, she's supposed to come over here and just try to fix the door because obviously the door was locked and then <laughs> they couldn't get the match out. So you were just like waiting over here. This over here was my uh, literature class. Um, over here, was my mathematics, geometry, uh, yeah, my math class. Yeah, it was a really nice teacher, uh, my favorite teacher. And then this is the third floor of the school. So now I'm gonna show you. My workstation class. We used to drink over here a lot of alcohol. Oh, check this out. They still look the same. <laughs> that was my work, like practical work class. This was my medical assistant uh, room where we used to get like our flu shots and stuff like that then that's the, our library and this was like art class over here actually it looks pretty much the same like it used to be and this over oh, here probably you're not gonna see it behind these doors are cafe school cafe he got some some cups over here, but now they're really old. And that's it. And then there's a wardrobe. I think that's it. And uh, that was a nice little school tour. Hi, folks. Uh, we're on our way to the wakeboarding camping site, where's the mini ramp. And we're gonna do like a little session of skateboarding. My parents are driving me there. And then on the way, to this wake park, we found this crazy car. So I'm just gonna show you how this car looks like. It's ridiculous. So guys, we just found a hedgehog, which is just walking across this uh, road. I'm gonna show you how this... Look at this baby! It's like my, my, my son. <laughs> hedgehog. What is that, eh? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So we just arrived at wakeboarding sort of um, resort <laughs> and uh, now there's a, like a mini ramp over here also. I'm just gonna try to skate it over.
place is awesome for ending up the vlog. I just did a time lapse. And then tomorrow morning I'm flying back to London. It's been amazing holidays, amazing days off, amazing time here back at home with all the excitements. And uh, yeah, so see you next time, guys. Hope you liked it. Bye.